Hey, welcome replay viewers. Welcome here in Tokyo, Japan. I'm here at 9 a.m. on Saturday morning. And over there, you can see a lot of people <laughs> waiting for, um, I think it's like something to do with manga. <laughs> and um, yesterday I tried to go live with, um, uh, with Streamlabs, but it failed, it failed, and it failed, and it failed. Hey team, welcome. And now I know why. <laughs> because i was pushing the data i'm so sorry for you yesterday i was pushing the data to amsterdam instead of tokyo japan hey smith from the bird welcome please let me know whether this quality is better than the scopes from earlier today because we should have high definition hd i repeat high definition thank you for retweeting thank you for sharing actually um on the top um, right, you can see Travel Japan um, over there, or maybe it's on the other side. <laughs> and I think we have some cool stuff coming up. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> yes, I was pushing, pushing, pushing. I was uh, unfortunately um, uh, pushing the wrong thing <laughs> in the wrong direction. Uh, but it's 9 a.m. And what you can see here, all the shops are still closed. Good to hear. I just see that um, I just have a, an issue with the commands popping in. Um, yes, the colors are spectacular because today is a ridiculously blue, ridiculously blue sky. My daily job. My daily job. My daily job. I'm an entrepreneur in the field of, uh, I prefer to call it the combination of technology, innovation, and people. Oh, here. Actually, I haven't had breakfast yet. And one of the things I really like is the soba. Uh, when I used to live over here, um, I was enjoying uh, really a lot of food here. And I like that. That soba. Actually, I want to I wanna have that one later. But I just want to travel around here, walk around here with you a little bit more. And uh, the shops are, oh my God. These are the 100 yen famous um, vending machines. And even at the most remote location, you can find Century Coffee. Uh, here usually they were like 100 yen each so you can just buy whatever you want and um, ridiculously bad in my opinion are the ones I don't ha don't have them here the cafe au lait cafe au lait they're so sweet <laughs> ah <laughs> yeah technology innovation people actually periscope also will uh, uh, is, is part of that huh um, the, the, the graphics, yes, I, I, unfortunately I didn't optimize it uh, for the blue background, I'm so sorry. This is uh, called uh, Streamlabs and uh, we are live with uh, iVideo. And uh, this is the Japanese version of, uh, Japanese version of uh, McDonald's. And if you can see here, the M <laughs> resembles the M, not from McDonald's, but it's like a golden arc <laughs> but then green huh so most of the shops are still closed and they will open up at uh, nine uh, nine ish uh, sorry ten and it's right nine o'clock so I need to kill one more hour uh, but I thought about just going live with you here with the stream that's because I think we should be able to to fix it because I was so annoyed yesterday. I can't tell you how much that we couldn't push, but right now we can. And yes, Dean, I'm a little bit pushy because I really got a little bit uh, frustrated. Oh, I get a little bit frustrated if things don't work, that should work. And then uh, I think it's baked in my DNA. I just want to solve it. I'm like a professional problem solver. I thought about crossing the street over here, uh, but instead of crossing, 
I just want to walk here in this direction. Oh, hi, guys. I'm asked. Good morning for the people in Europe. Good night. And in America, good afternoon, good evening. Uh, this seems to me like a cool street. Just want to give you like the combination in the Travel Japan tour. On the top right, you can follow the hashtag Travel Japan. Follow Yuka Hamel 005. Follow Swiss Mike, Swiss Mike, who is in Hong Kong right now, together with John Ho and with JL Switzerland. And we're still walking here in Tokyo, Japan, finding the shrine thank you for retweeting i just saw it and just clear skies as you can see here blue more bluer than blue and this is the electrical city or in other words akihabara but i have already seen from some youtubers um, that were here like around last year it has a hey, taiwan MSI, uh, that it has changed a lot in the last 13, 14 years. Necess not necessarily bad or good, it just changed. Hey, do we need to buy something? 100 yen. Um, I think what kind of cables do we need? Or is this like a SATA? No, no, I don't need it. What do we need here? Other plugs? Actually, I need a need something. Hey, but these are not the authentic Japanese people. Actually, at that time when I was living here, 2003, I just had a chat with somebody who is from the gaming industry in front of the Tokyo station. Just after I finished my uh, um, my YouTube, uh, my my Periscope, I had a chat with a guy from uh, Justin. A guy from uh, from right now he lives in LA. He's in the gaming industry, and he also used to live in uh, Tokyo. And he also mentioned it uh, has changed a lot. This environment, a lot of tourists, millions and millions of tourists just go to Japan. I know why because it's such a different environment, really vivid. But I just also see what we are doing together. Um, I mean, as a, as a group of uh, foreigners, we are changing the uh, authenticity of the, the original Japan. He has lived in, Tai uh, in Japan. I lived in Ikebukuro. I thought about going there this morning um, near Kokokuji. Kukukuji. Oh, by the way, this is also cool stuff. Uh, anyone, anybody fancy a laptop? Hey, Dean, do you still need a laptop? Um, probably. They're all Japanese brand. And they just need to work. I feel a little bit. <laughs> A little bit like embarrassing that, that I'm just making those video. I want to drive that one. Big run of a, ah. I see that there are already some shops that are open. Actually, I need to buy some glue. I don't know what the... What's the name for glue? I can use the Google Translate, huh? Google Translate. Glue. Glue. <laughs> glue doko desu ka? Uh, where is the translate app? I'm sorry to keep you waiting. Oh, by the way, here you also have the, like the stamps. Yes. Mori? 
Japanese. Let, let me have a look. Maybe, yes. Glue. Mori. Ah, Nori. Nori. Just use a Nori. Ah. Is that going to be a Nori? Where is it? Nori. Nori. Ah, Nori. Ah, uh, 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 stick. Uh, nori. Ah. So fast. Um, I want oh, to have. Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, this one. Yes. It's very fast. Yes. Very fast. Very fast. Uh, How One hundred. One hundred yes. yen. Yes. Ah, oh, good price. <laughs> One hundred yen. The. So I need to fix my unit here. Uh, 100. Oh! Uh, maybe, maybe one. I have eight. Eight. Just wait for the 80 cents. Oh! Oh! San? Oh, oh, San, San. San. Taking care of the money here. Just need to open this one. Ah. Sorry to keep you waiting. Oh. Thank you. Mm. Almost finished. Mm. I need to glue here my gimbal because it's not stable enough. Very fast. Mm. Thank you. Mm. So, that's it. I fixed it. That was an easy fix. Thank you for helping me with the Nori. Nori. Because um, I have this uh, tripod and this uh, tripod actually is really more for uh, um, he has light cameras, light stuff, and I'm just having this gimbal. And if I just put the tripod somewhere, then the gimbal just cannot, I mean, just too hot, too strong. And then just everything will fall down. I like, this is also really for me, like Japanese, huh? the, the white, usually they're red actually. Huh? Hey Dean, you should, should we do again uh, some, somewhere this week, like an epic scope? Like one that is like uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten hours long. I think we should. We still have some time. Thank you for inviting your followers. And if you think about going to Asia, I mean, think about going to iVideo. They are really helping me out with uh, high quality internet over here. Hopefully the glue, the nori will dry fast. Ah, thank you. Yeah, I think also the quality is better than last time. Only think the 
comments are popping up not in the right way. I think it's uh, I should have like a special setting for it. So where are we on the map? Let me have a look. It's, it's so convenient nowadays that you can have um, Google Maps so you know exactly where you are because it can be sometimes so difficult, especially in Japan, if you don't have a map where you are. But nowadays it's so convenient to move around. You just pop up Google Maps wherever you are in the world. Ah, not really wherever, but most of the places. Mm. I like those small streets. For me, that is really like the... If you watch it, a movie... I mean, this could be really... This could be just a movie set. Like somebody like living in the, uh, one of those apartments, getting out, having a conflict, or there's a problem that needs to be solved. Hey, this is interesting. These are the bikes. It's bike efficiency. It's the only Japanese know by heart. Oh, oh, she does. Ah, I forgot, this is the hiragana. I forgot to. Hi, Rob. Rob from Oakville. It's Friday. Getting Friday evening, eh? Yes, oh, lovely. My, um, gimbal is fixed my tripod is fixed so we are using a uh, different settings right now we have uh, the restream program that takes care of it no I know Google Maps is not uh, available in Korea and not available in China but uh, I think in general if you think about the oh this is oh my god this is lovely i would like to have my camera with me this i mean imagine that you have somebody with a kimono getting out of that this wooden house i mean more authentic than this i mean this is for me, this is really cool. It feels like I'm back. Thank you for following me, by the way. Uh, we are doing the... Travel Japan. Yeah, or a geisha. Dave in Osaka, he's uh, looking always for geisha. <laughs> uh, not really always, but... If we go up, it means we also need to go down, huh? Let's go up. I have a Japanese motorcycle, a Yamaha SR400. And this one, in a certain way, looks like it. Is this the famous SR? 
series. Whoa. I think it is. Oh my God, it's a real one. What a pleasant surprise. Actually, if you make a picture of this one and look to the one I made, I mean, I have, it's the same. It's actually three, they call it SR400, but it's a 399cc because uh, uh, then it's like a small motorbike, motorcycle. Otherwise, um, you need to have like an additional license to. Surprise, surprise. What's so special about that bike? So it R2. And second thing is, I it has a bad connection. You're still with me. Hey Toronto. Um, I'm looking for a sound, a sign to understand where we are. Here it says already uh, on top which temple this is, but I can't read that one. Let's have a look at uh, Google Maps. Again, here on the left hand side, it's maybe difficult to see. It's um, one of the protectors uh, of the, the temple. Also here is the other one. That's lovely, yeah? As you can see here, there are more people awake compared to um, um, the previous scope. This is called the Kanda. Miyu, Miyu Jin, Miyu Yin Shrine, Kanda Shrine, yes. How do you know that? <laughs> Thank you so much, really so helpful. So about the bike story, just remind, just remember that that's my favorite bike. <laughs> and just bought it last year, brand new like a new series from 2017, which is inspired by the, uh, by the old one. And again, you also feel here the relaxing environment. Uh, there you can, oh, this is also a beautiful image. Kazuki bean there, ah, <laughs> Kazuki bean. Unfortunately, I forgot to record this again <laughs> because I was uh, just trying out. Kanda. So another protector. Already bowed two times for the people who didn't see me doing that. Out of respect. And um, it's also like a great view like this uh, with the. This looks like a combination of a lion and a dog. Oh, you saw the name? Yeah, of course. Kanda. So you, John Ho is not with me. John Ho is still in. Um, um, he is still in Shanghai in uh, Hong Kong, but he will arrive on Monday morning. But uh, this is like the, like the. Like the pre-stream, the pre-periscope, and here again you can see the um, yeah 
maybe we have an, an English one here. Korean. Korean. Uh, Louise Poppy, um, I think we have a big meeting uh, scheduled in Osaka on Monday evening, uh, Japanese time, which is GMT plus nine. And I think Louisa will also be there. We will meet about 15 to 20, I forgot, but something like this. No, to the shrine. Akihabara is going to the shrine but actually I really like it a lot Okanda yeah because yes I will be, be I will be there JB I will be there actually uh, we had a chat with the people from uh, from Periscope community really from the Periscope people and um, Oh, cool. So, Louisa is also like famous, huh? Oh, so like Sakura. I like this uh, this gate. I'm just thinking about the the question about Japan. What I love the most. Maybe it's a little bit corny to say, but it's uh, just the, the culture, which is so completely different from us in, in a positive way. Um, the culture feels so much um, authentic to me and so relaxed and peaceful. No, no much anger. Yeah, so we are now live on uh, YouTube and on Twitch. Just have a look. Oh, here you can buy those um, those wooden parts you can write down. Uh, I also want to do that somewhere. Oh, here, the Lucky Dolls. Lucky Dolls. Huh. I'm not sure if you should, should film them, but just look really... I Kanda. But they are still closed, this shop. They will open probably also at University. Uh, um, I was just with some. Um, Here you can see the kanda. We have uh, more vending machines for the black. Hey, we are back. I don't know what happened. Yes, the connection is uh, bumpy. I think there was a um, like a cold spot or a black spot because uh, I have two Wi-Fi boxes, one from iVideo and one from, I need to check from which company, I just bought it in Taiwan as a, as a backup. But both just 
went down exactly at the same time. Uh, it, it's definitely time for sushi, actually. It's always time for sushi. A lot of people like sushi. And uh, unfortunately, because uh, I've, uh, I've had one of the best sushi in the whole world here in Tokyo and in Osaka, um, to eat sushi outside Tokyo is a little bit difficult for me. Maybe I just need to ask the real authentic Japanese people where they eat, where I am at that specific moment to understand what is the good quality because no, most of the time it's, uh, I don't want to say rubbish, but the quality is just uh, so par or what's that? Uh, my favorite sushi is the uni. The uni, which is from the what, sea urchin. And I had that in Taiwan, uh, but not as a sushi, but as a sashimi. But then I understood the, the delicious taste. It's like, oh my God, it's so tender. It's so smooth on your tongue. Uh, the other one I like is uh, really a lot, is the Toro, the really fat um, Japanese um, tuna. But I think the uni is not number one for me. I also remember uh, I ate uh, a lot of those, um, what's that called? With the fish axe, the salmon fish axe. A little bit sea salty are the unis. It remembers me a little bit of the, um, what's it called, goose liver. Goose liver also has, if you have good quality, um, a certain texture. And if you take the goose liver and you make it like a small mousse of it, so just, in, yeah, just pump in j just a little bit of the uh, the air, not too much. It's just so delicious. It's a uh, nine o'clock and I still haven't had breakfast and I was already awake since six. So I definitely need to eat something, yeah. But I'm not sure, shall, shall I just take you with me? Hey, Lamian. Maybe it's just a better idea to, uh, to stop the scope, huh? Otherwise you can see my eating. I don't wanna lose my face. Maybe you should have a look at something else. Oh, here, there's a... This neighborhood used to be... Sorry, Oh, Samurai, Merchant and Craftsman. Battle between... Yes, let's go eat. <laughs> Abalone sushi, yes. But honestly, um, for me, a lot of uh, sushi, um, I don't want to say they are similar, but it's difficult to remember. I, I remember uh, two, three years ago, I was with um, our Japanese uh, partner here in, um, uh, oh, not here, but we, I was in um, uh, Kobe and together with uh, my colleague, he was also flying from uh, the Netherlands to Japan. We had some uh, demonstration at some key institutes here. And uh, we had, oh, I remember we were here before. and. We just had the one, you know, also such a delicious uh, sashimi and uh, sushi. Shabu shabu and uh, Japanese barbecue. 
and the what what for me is always so amazing the amount of dedication they put in preparing their food preparing the machinery preparing basically i don't want to say everything but a lot of things are really dedicated to dedicated uh, yes this is the soba soba i want to have this one uh, what let's make a picture otherwise i just get confused and now i need to remember that i should not speak a chinese because that's what i i will do just make one picture for reference only and then we need to find it again at the machine here I like this way of uh, ordering so very efficient if you know exactly where it is so where is mine <laughs> Where is mine? I think Foucault E this one, that's mine. So six eighteen. And I need to pay. So here I need to put the money in. Do I have enough money with me? But where? Where's my money? Where's the money, Blabowski? Where's the money? Yes, I got money. So now you put the money into the machine. Oh, the table. Got it. Got it. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, table. I mean, are you okay? doesn't accept my coin why not yes now it does so now it accepted the coin so this is really cool so you get the ticket you get the money so I want to have a Let me. Something went wrong here. Just try to squeeze in here. Where are we? What about changing the camera now? Where are you? I just by accident put some um, glue and from the guy who said it was very fast on my on my hands. I'm afraid it's really sticks so much to my to my uh, finger. It just destroys it a little bit. really aggressive no most of the time they don't um, th they don't accept the the cards it's so hot here I, I would guess it's like 25 at least 25 degrees Celsius I'm interested to understand, to know where's Mike because uh, Mike from um, where's, where's Mike? I think maybe I should put some water in here. Maybe it will get worse. Hang on, I will be back uh, shortly.
just waiting now for the soba. And hey, Mike, wh where are you? <laughs> are you um, in uh, in Shenzhen almost? The chemistry. I was um, in chemistry class. I was focused on organic chemistry and in combination with what's called flow chemistry. So I was one of the pioneers in flow chemistry. And right now, more and more people um, understand about the, the power of flow chemistry. And so we have introduced our technology um, in about, I forgot, 24 countries now, which is really cool. Also here in Japan. We have uh, our machine. Uh, so, Mike, what's the plan for today then? If you don't go to um, Shenzhen today. I think I really destroyed my finger. Yes, flow chemistry is a, um, um, is a different approach compared to the regular organic chemistry. So usually what chemists do is they have to... Oh. 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 I just want to show you what I'm eating here. It's, um, a lot of people don't like it. Um, but I like it a lot. This is um, cold soba. Um, so these are like buckwheat noodles. And this is like raw egg with some meat and some rice and here you have the the um, yeah the sauce and i don't want to look ridiculous but i think what i remember correctly you need to take the soba noodles put them in the sauce and then mm. Mm. These are the cold ones. I I prefer the cold ones because most of the time, many people eat everything hot, hot, hot. I mean uh, the noodles. And this is also the the raw egg. A lot of people really cannot. I want to show you. Maybe I I need to bring that. This like raw egg. You just mix it with the rice. Really delicious. Mm, yeah. Oh my god. Mm. I think as mm. yesterday somebody commented, hey, what's happy? Yesterday somebody commented and they say you should not um, you should not put um, like the condiments on top of something that you ordered. But I don't agree because some of the condiments you know you need to put them in here. This I think is a like a small plum or it looks like a cherry actually. Hey Mike, what are you eating this morning? You also hear the, the onions, spring onions. Mm. This is also, I think this is pepper as I remember. Oh no, this is the chili, chili flakes. And um, now it's 10 o'clock, so that means all the shops are, are open. So we should have a, have a look. But yeah, going to Hard Rock Cafe in Hong Kong, you're not going there the whole day or are you? I mean, that's like the dessert. What is your main dish? French fries with peanut sauce. Mm. Uh, a lot of Dutch people like that. 
and not went to the french fries mm. Mm. wow it's a ume like a ume flavor ume is like a a very salty um plum you also have the ume sauce a lot of people really do not like it but i like it a lot I remember when my, my mother gave me the ume pasta when I was like eight or nine years old. She put it on the cheese sandwich. Mm. Fides, yeah. Fides, you're a great person to have um, in my crowd. You have asked great questions. Keep it nice and spicy. Go. Mm. Yeah, a lot of people enjoy their fries in a different way. I like to enjoy my fries with the mayonnaise, not the fake ones with sugar, but the real one. Mm. Preferably handmade. And it's really, really easy to make mayonnaise yourself. You just need to have the basic ingredients as uh, oil, vinegar, and mustard. Mm. An egg. Oh, that's sad. It's raining. Here, it's the most ridiculous blue skies. Mm. That's the thing which is really annoying if you go to another country and um, you're really looking forward to it and it's raining. Eh? But luckily you can change your plans. And Mike, I'm not sure, but I don't think you are a shopping guy, but there are a lot of things to shop. No. Oh, sorry, in Hong Kong. Oh yeah, about the flow chemistry. So usually the chemists put their chemicals into a beaker or like a flask and then they just stir, basically initiating the chemical reaction. But that's not a very well controlled process because the heat is not dissipated very evenly inside such a tank. A much better way to control the chemical reaction is by running them in a continuous way by adding two different uh, streams so these can be like the pipes so this is compound a, a this is compound b so you basically you put them together you push them through together and then here the point that they meet their chemical reaction will start so if you have the third one which is like basically here and that one will be the, the chemical reaction taking place and it's much more efficient having much more control over the chemical reaction and thereby Eliminate, eliminate certain byproducts or uh, create certain products that you otherwise cannot produce. Mm. And people use it around the whole world right now to um, to make, especially for the pharmaceutical industry or the nano industry industry to make new chemicals that otherwise were very difficult or very dangerous to produce mm. it's a rather new field I think about 20 years now but some people say it's already 100 years because the technology is already there for the petrochemistry which means like the the ones for your petrol fuels and all those bulk processes are all done in a continuous way but what we call the boutique chemistry or the fine or ultra fine chemical industry doesn't use that but that is changing especially for making a better environment 
uh, like uh, reducing the CO2 fo footprint, the energy, to think about more efficient way to um, process your chemistry. Flow chemistry is a way to do that. Ten past ten, over almost. Mike, did you already buy a new uh, SIM card? Hmm. Mm. I see somebody twitter something about oh yeah, Taiwan travel. Every time when you tweet of Taiwan Travel, or Mike, or JL, or my name, or Yuka's name, it will show up here. Or show up there, actually. Mm. I'm not sure how long it will stay. You broke the Wi-Fi? <laughs> I don't know, you can break it. Mm. Yeah, Mike did buy it. Mm. So if you tweet, one of the names are top here or there. But sometimes the restream chat breaks. Mm. But Mike, you are the IT professional. You can fix everything, eh? Mr. Fix it. By the way, I don't have any fruits right now. I miss the fruits. I definitely have to have some fruits somewhere today. There are too much gluten here. Actually, bookweed, bookweed, bookweed doesn't have any gluten. Hey, Teresa, where are you? Tokyo. Welcome. My meeting will be around two. I really look forward to that one. You just landed. Welcome. Welcome in Tokyo. Welcome in Japan. There are three ways, or actually four ways, to get into Tokyo. Uh, there are a lot of ways, but most standard ways people take the Narita Express or the Skyliner. I took the Skyliner. And you have the one, the slower one, which is also fun if you're the first time in, in uh, Japan because you can enjoy, especially during the day, the beautiful uh, buildings, the structures. Really, um, really enjoyable. It's also actually cheaper to do that. But yesterday I took the Skyliner because it was dark. Hmm. I just finished the noodles. I'm now eating them. Oh my God, the dish is rice. Hmm. 
Ricardo with JR Puff? I'm not so sure. But I am sure with a JR Puff you can get in. But mine is only vetted for seven days, so I had to pay one. I will validate my card later. Later today. I'm so sorry. Usually I never eat and talk. But I feel like I need to entertain you in a certain way, huh? Mm. Let's continue. So now we go to my next destination, which is Electrical Town. Um, I remember the first time I was here, uh, the, the mobile phones were coming up. What's the best way to remove air bubbles from high pressure water without lowering the pressure? Removing air bubbles. without lowering the pressure. It, wouldn't that be gravity? Make seat reservation for the character into a second for the right size. Oh yes, I, actually that's a good point. I, I want, want to talk uh, about that with you, uh, Mike, about the reservation of the seats. Oh, I have a, a battery issue. But luckily I have a power bank, a power bank with me, which is uh, good enough to be online for uh, the rest of the whole trip. <laughs> no, 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 I'm just kidding. It's just, just uh, the agitation. Ah, oh, yes, that's, that is, actually you're right, you're right. I know actually that they're using the ultrasonic Basically, they will explode. Actually, it's a very interesting way uh, to break certain um, peptides and proteins with the ultrasonic agitation. But that is a whole because I have too many things. Hundwadongshi of the all the electronics, but um, we all. Yes, I'd like to talk about uh, science and technology as well, especially to learn from it. Oh, this is also cool. I'll show you. Uh, yesterday I had a tempura. Also delicious, but let's go outside. I don't want to... Oh, I got another Oh. I just, <laughs> I just want to say thank you in Chinese every time. Sorry, Mike. The red weather here is ridiculously good. Mario. So there's a whole, I forgot, uh, culture what the name is it, but uh, the whole culture about like the manga and uh, all those things I don't understand. What is so cool about this, but a lot of uh, people like it. Yeah, ultrasonic is really also very good for, for cleaning things. Oh, it's not, not open yet. Just need to wait. Hey. We want to buy. Hey, thank you for. Oh, thank you for sharing the tweet. So I think this is the moment we need to. 
retweet, huh? Oh, I've seen so many tourists like me that it's really, really changed. I remember when I was here walking, there was like, I already mentioned this maybe before, yes, I'm sure. I was the, like the only white guaran, only the guy, what, what's the, how to say it in Japanese, gaijin. Ah, engine parts. <laughs> I remember ultra baths uh, are also used sometimes to clean uh, lenses. But you also need to be careful, do not put your finger in the ultrasonic because it can really destroy your body, your cells. I forgot how many energy is, is there. Gaijin, gu, Gujin, no, I, I forgot. Gaijin, how to pronounce foreigner. Um, the good thing is if you're now a tourist here, it's, they don't want to take pictures of you every time, so it's more relaxing to walk. You're not like an attraction. Hey, I would expect they would already open all the stores here. Oh yes, that is what I want to talk here to you uh, about that. About in 2003 here, um, oh, yeah, Fides, crisp and clear, thank you. The first time I was here, uh, that was a time, the era, that iMode. Maybe somebody of you knows, knows iMode. It was like before we had a, um, what is it called? Yeah, just like the internet, we had a um, iMode. So, hey, drone fire, Nick. And then they sold here everywhere. They sold phones with iMode. That was the thing at that moment at that moment. But right now, I remember every shop here, every shop here was phone, 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 phone. Right now, I, I, I haven't seen any phone. Only those crazy, I don't know what is so fun about it, huh? Maybe people need to explain what is the, the deal. <laughs> Phone market is saturated, but it's saturated in such a way that there are not even any... <laughs> oh, Tamagotchi. Tamagotchi. Yes, I want, I want to go to that, that place later, but um, peak here. Oh, all kinds of hey, do we need still need an audio cable, <laughs> Mike? <laughs> hmm. But uh, if you have seen uh, Shenzhen, I mean, I don't want to say this is nothing, but it's, uh, it's different. Let's go here to the left side. I remember the big Kameda. That's one of the very famous shops in here. Uh, about eight floors of uh, electronics. But I, I, I'm not so excited about that anymore. 
not because I get older and older, but also because the the world is getting more. Yeah, at that time we didn't have AliExpress. Uh, we really want to go to the other one. Eight track player. <laughs> they definitely have. Which one should we bring back home? Special event. Tofu. Let's go. I think a break. I broke again the uh, commands. I just have to, I don't know why this happens. Maybe we need to contact the restream people. Ooh. Huh? How come? So this is the, what I want to show you, this, uh, this market. Um, they have all kinds of uh, equipment. I think this is pretty expensive. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Volkswagen. Oh, Mike, if you're still there, um, I have two of them to use with me. I brought them from... Uh, uh, might, be, might be handy. Here are the d dirty underwear. So you just put a thousand yen in it. And you will get the dirty underwear. Is that Audi? This is a... Uh, yeah, so I already have a couple of them. Actually, I need to buy a SD card. I, I lost mine. I don't want to lose by just it's gone but it's just broken oh Dean <laughs> you want to have my power wow it's really 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 strong Yeah, the automotive industry is uh, still growing. Mike, I think we need to buy one of these. It's a, it's, a, it's a way so it's better for us so we can see each other. Hey, Dean, welcome back, or you have to go. So if, uh, if you see everybody or anybody in... Uh, um, scoping or YouTubing in Akihabara, usually they will go to this spot because this is one of the most famous exits and has his birthday today. You're kidding me. We need to buy something for him. More chocolate. Yeah, here you can see the Laox home electronic store and but what I see but I um I'm not really not the kind of person who can educate or tell you about it, but people are really crazy about these. I will show you. This. 
what what is this why is this so popular why do you need to pay 4000 yen for those creatures and they have like shops shops many 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 shops o otakada is this called otakada i don't know is it like if you have a fortune or if you're I don't know what what's what are you going to do with that? I mean, for kid, for children, I can understand because you want to collect something or play with it. But for a 25-year-old dude, here you have a yeah. But what what can you do with those action figures? Doesn't look bad actually. This one. Also these figures, I mean, please somebody educate me. Why do you want to buy? <laughs> Maybe Mike, why, why do you want to buy something like this <laughs> when you're 25 years old? <laughs> I think it's, uh, it's cute. It's cute. Ah, these are comics. Or oh, maybe you're right. You are right. That's it. They're from the comics. And because uh, I don't know and understand those comics, I, I have no idea. But this is like the Looky Luke. Or the... Um, uh, <laughs> Yes, it's a completely different. But I also know a lot of um, like Western people like to enjoy and co go here for Tokyo only for that culture. Also here, carts. Let me let me have a look at this shop. It's like Magic uh, the Gathering, but then the, a Japanese version. Maybe I should just buy one as a, as a gift, as a reminder. Oh yes. I get a better understanding now. So those figures are action figures. And those action figures are from the comics. That makes sense. Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> yes, I thought about going to Harajuku. But uh, I will do that tomorrow because Harajuka is very famous for that, uh, that culture, uh, for all those costumes and those ladies dressed up in, in different kind of clothing. Just wanna... Move around here a little bit more. Waiting. Yes, and here you can buy. I remember. Mike will arrive on Sunday evening. Yeah, so I remember the first time 
I was shopping here in Akihabara, I was really looking for a small laptop because at that time we didn't have like uh, small ones available. So I bought a, I still have it, a Panasonic. It was more like a Hey, also, was haben wir hier? An Bratwurst, ne? Schweinhaxe. Hopefully it will stay dry. Everybody can talk about the rain. Of course, we can buy some uh, umbrellas, but I prefer just to uh, keep it dry. Yes, I'm now walking towards towards the uh, Udobashi because in my opinion that is like the the most crazy electronic part here why because uh, um, I think they will also have that today here it will be very very loud ladies with microphones shouting what you need to buy and uh, other crazy noises. Seems to me that the quality today is pretty good, huh? Maybe we should do another retweet. I can't do that. Maybe somebody else can help me. Oh, maybe I need to ask to share. HD, yes. I uh, bought a Zoom H6N uh, in Europe. I just think about <laughs> these are from Japan. Uh, this is for really high class uh, audio. I also bought a Dat Cat. Um, hey, thank you, Mike, for your retweet. As you can see on the right corner, bottom right corner you can see that yeah zoom h6 yes a tofu i uh, i bought it uh, but i just think about it it's from japan so maybe it will be uh uh cheaper here i'm not too sure actually but here we can buy it tax free so i paid uh, a lot <laughs> a lot for it uh. so there So what are they selling? Probably SoftBank. Thank you, uh, Fides. Fides, thank you. 50 inch screen. <laughs> I just try to uh, try to have an idea about the this area. See on the at the far end, you can see. Uh, I can help you to point it. There we have big camera. So big camera is a, one of the big uh, shopping centers only for like like um, for for electronics and stuff. And here you have Yodobashi, and these are the two big competitors, uh, for as I know, in uh, in Japan. You can see them also in uh, Osaka. We will see them. And there are like uh, six floors. 
of all kinds of things he can buy. And I'm not sure if we can get in with a camera. I just want to walk around a little bit. Yeah, the blue sky is uh, admirable. Eh? Actually, I should just be outside the whole day. There was a kid that was already uh, um, interested, I would say, into those so-called capsule stations. Here uh, we have uh, here the Fille de France uh, bakery, and um, as you can see here, they all all sell kinds of French-style bakeries and. It's like a like a mall, yes. But this uh, this mall, actually, the big camera and the Yodabashi is really dedicated for electronics. Oh, here! Ah, yes, they still have them. These are the translation. Yeah, this is for ch translate Chinese. Uh, sorry, uh, Japanese into English. I have no idea why people still sell them because nowadays. We have uh, Google Translate, so why would you need them to walk around with another device? There must be a good reason, otherwise they won't sell them. And also here everything looks very, very clean. Huh? Yeah, I understand the tofu, the dictionary idea, the concept, but uh, nowadays you have, um, I'm looking for, in the meantime, I'm looking for some cash because I want to buy a black coffee. So, I, I remember, you, you need to pay attention. You have the so-called red drinks and you have the blue drinks, the cold one and the hot one. Uh, but I don't want to drink the hot coffee. I want to drink the cold coffee. Um, but unfortunately, they don't have a cold coffee. Oh no, they have here. It's a, oh so much light here. Let me have a look. I want to have this one, the Aromax. So I'll just put in the coin, press the button. Uh, collect the remaining coins from the machine. Now we have the the black coffee. Um, how should I open it? Because I have my hands full with other stuff. Where can I put? You guys, ah, oh, let's over here. I think that's a good location. Tofu, yes, cold coffee. So this is called the Aromax. Luxurious taste and rich aroma. Premium black. I think it's a. Uh, This is a problem. What is a problem? You got a problem? Should I make you a moderator? Oh, Dean, welcome. Welcome. And um, I think, uh, hey Dean, I think it isn't that wonderful to have these different vending machines uh, on the background. Oh, somebody's trying to push his bike. <sighs> Premium black, the best coffee in Taiwan, uh, Japan. I remember um, Lost in Translation, maybe you also know that movie. Um, after seeing that movie, I visited 
that um, maybe like many other people in Tokyo, visited many of the places, um, even the, the hotel, actually also the, um, the lobby from the hotel, where I forgot the name, this lovely lady went to. A good ad for Pepsi. <laughs> Uh, the ingredients, yes, uh, yes, I want to read them for you guys, but everything is only in Japanese, I, here, it's, it's, uh, it's just in Japanese, I can't read them for you, and I see, I don't know why the commands there is something wrong with the commands. After an hour or something, it, or not hour, like 20 minutes, it just stopped. Hey, Ranwas. Exactly, Mrs. Scarlet. And also, um, I went to the, the room, probably it will be just too crazy right now, the room from the karaoke bar they went. Um, so with the view, it was also really lovely. And um, let me think about the other places. I just made a list of all the things you could go to. The taste. <clears throat> if you go to a, a very good high quality uh, cup of coffee shop and you ask them for um, a strong American coffee, coffee um, without sugar and, or just an espresso, I could say, and just put some ice cubes in it and then just um, leave it there. So it's a strong taste. It's not, not acidous, it's not, no sweet, there's no sugar in it. I think, I believe, it's only, um, um, yeah, coffee. Just extracted coffee. Let me think about where to put my, yeah, this is battery pack one and the other one I have on my back. So, what's the next station? Let me have a look. Oh, we already had a commercial for Pepsi, eh? This um, show is brought to you by Effects. Um, I think, I'm not sure if we can. Aqua, e-power. Camera enhance auto scene. Yes, just need to check something more. Uh, exposure, where are you? Yes, that's good. So, what's the next step? I want to have a pH meters. Um, I want to walk around a little bit. Um, oh yes, I forgot. We we were on the route to uh, towards uh, Yodobashi. I got distracted because of the the black coffee. What did I do with the coffee? Did I? I just want to want to double check. Maybe I just left it, and then I really feel so bad. Yes, I still have it. I still have it. Don't worry. Don't worry. I need to put it in the. Switch to YouTube. Dean, what is the quality on YouTube? <laughs> Everybody. Yodobashi camera. Hey, batteries. Actually, I need to buy some. 
Um, I was just walking here, and uh, no, 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 I d do not get um, thrown out, but uh, SD card, yes, SD card, Swiss Mike, thank you. I need to buy the SD card. Hey, Carmi, welcome. Hey, I'm sorry, I, I, these are again the capsule station. I want to get in, but uh, the quality will get too bad for me. <laughs> Fidas, I'd love to hear that. <laughs> oh, I want to see, can you make a picture of your of yourself with a selfie on your TV screen on the back with me? And then uh, just share that on Twitter or just DM me directly. I really appreciate it. I really think that is so cool. So people are really here who want to get into this uh, Square Enix. Yeah, Mike, I will uh, get in, don't worry. I uh, need to buy the SD card, I need to buy the batteries. And what was the other thing I need to buy? I forgot. Batteries, SD card. Oh. Five tons of garbage separated every single part in a blue truck leaving Akihabara. Hey, John Sabo, welcome here. Welcome in Tokyo, Japan. I was thinking about you, John, uh, when I was walking here uh, in the early morning around seven. Uh, every time when I listen to your um, um, uh, your podcast, it says, I'm here in Tokyo, Japan. It's in the early morning. I'm on, on one of the only person here walking around here, something like this. I love that sentence. Yes, I remember you were in the Tsukiji fish market, which has been moved recently. And I'm not really shopping for something. Actually, uh, the, um, I need to buy something, but it's not really shopping. I just need to, need to buy some batteries. I want to get in, um, but I'm, I'm, I'm afraid I will lose you. So if I lose you, just please make sure you follow me before that time. So you can, you can always come back later. Please also follow Swiss Mike and John Sabo. Swiss Mike, because he will be soon with me and John Sabo, because he's making some really cool stuff. Actually, John, I have a scam I want to share with you. As a, as a scam, uh, what happened to me recently in, um, um, in China, it's about money. Yes. John, what happened with his stream labs yesterday? I was so stupid. I was streaming to, um, you have a, you have different uh, servers. So one of the server settings is like, what is the location? Uh, so I was streaming to, um, to Amsterdam. So of course you have a big delay. So when I switched this morning from Amsterdam to Tokyo, all the problems were gone and I could stream seamlessly using the iVideo hotspot. It's just good quality. Only if you go inside the building, um, you need to have like a, like like a um, like an antenna, external antenna, which I actually have, um, but that doesn't fit with that external box. Uh, box, but it's not really a problem right now. Uh, so I really recommend to you or anyone who does uh, live streaming just to try out the Streamlabs uh, app. Um, just to see if it works. Yes, John, I want to share that with uh, with you on your podcast, but you need to be online when I'm also will be online. Huh? So uh, thank you so much for joining. I can get in. Uh, so probably I will lose you throughout the whole adventure and otherwise uh, bear with me. So um, let's try.
Oh, uh, I thought we can go in here, but uh, we need to try. Oh, what about this way? It says, I always like the, the small adventures. There's nobody here. <laughs> Butter is always a vending machine. Actually, these vending machines are probably for the people who uh, will work inside the building and they want to uh, have a smoke. Thank you. Stuff only. <laughs> so next time you can just use this. So I need to buy the SD card, but th this is like a eight stories, eight story building. Uh, I remember I was spending uh, during a rainy uh, afternoon here about three hours in the, uh, yes, it was the X sign saying, no, no, we don't have it. You're not allowed to get in. So hygienic. Oh, this is a Wacom. It's also basically you can get rides here. Yes, and then you can. I don't think this is uh, similar like Nova. This is uh, this is just too crazy. Need, do you need a keyboard? And then uh, you think you're finished, but then you still have another keyboard. And then you think you're finished, and then there's another. Oh, I just I, for me it's just uh, mind blowing uh, in, in a way that. There's just too much, too much. I want to bring a mic to uh, to here. So right now, here, I am here in Tokyo. Um, John is in Vietnam in Saigon, Ho Chi Minh City and Swiss Mike is in Shanghai, Hong Kong, which is here. Oh, am I right? Or this one? I, I cannot read the Japanese. And Dean, where are you? Dean is here. But um, let's look for the... I need a scissor. 
which one should you take? Oh man, oh my God, it's just, it, it, it's, it's too much. I, I cannot handle this. It, it's like capitalism till like the maximum. Oh, you're, <laughs> you're in Montreal. I, I remember um, I saw the documentary um, or like movie documentary, it's like a combination, I forgot. What's the name? It's uh, about the lady in um, the, the wall, the, the wall between Eastern and Western Germany just falls down. And also in that, that movie, um, basically you see one scissor, one thing, and here it's just ridiculous. You, so many things. So these are very, very popular. Um, uh, important things for children. These are made in Japan. You can buy them everywhere in the in the world, uh, but mainly here in, in Japan because um, this is really high quality. So you have the children uh, walk around there um, when they're I'm not sure what age, but when they go probably to elementary school. Sometimes I feel it's more like a moving back with some. Uh, some feet, but this doesn't seem to me like they have the SD card. SD card. SD card va doko desu ka? Maybe go up one more. And probably uh, the SD cards, they will sell them at the ground level because uh, Probably a lot of people need to buy them. They also sell uh, Blu-ray. Ah, do they sell sell the DVDs? We got a poor connection here. Hopefully, it's getting better and better. Bang and Olufsen. I just got so dizzy here. It's like so much capitalism. I can't handle it. I see cards. Asuma-san, uh, SD card wa doko desu ka? Sanke. Oh. So we need to go to the third floor. But what, why do the third floor? They also sell them here. Maybe, maybe I'm lost. Um, which one do I need to buy? Because I'm afraid it's 80. Sandisk, they are all from um, Taiwan, huh? Yes, so I need to go to the third floor just to, uh, to buy them, let's do it. Oh. Yeah, maybe you're right. Also like, like these, oh, it's such a good quality. Huh? But I think it's just annoying. Everything uh, on the third floor, yes. I, on my way, sir, on my way. I, uh, but which floor is this one? Oh, this is five. Let's go back to three. Two. Yeah, that's the the sound of the the, the shop here. Uh, so, hey, we go from five to three. Camera. Oh yes, this is cameras. It's overwhelming. Yeah, it's uh, that's what I said. It's just uh, the complete opposite of uh, this early morning scope. Uh, all the tweets on the right bottom corner are all the tweets that use the hashtag 
uh, Swiss Mike, JL Switzerland, Castor, Hamel, John M. Ho, or use the hashtag Travel Japan. So if you retweet this one, you can see this right away. Or if you want to make a comment that sticks, you can use it. That is uh, Chinese. A lot of people want to go here. Hey, who's that guy? What? Oh. That's, uh, that was cool, huh? The guy from the camera. Actually, I, I have a buyao don't need. Yes, bu means not and yao means is want. Buyao means do not want. Wo biao, wo means ik, uh, me. Like watashi. Tough. Oh. oh. And of course we have the problem uh, because there are like 1 million SD cards they want to sell me. Which one to choose? Wo? Yeah. Actually it's not, not W O. It's, it's the way we pronounce. Oh, before going to the SD cards, I want to show you the Toto Washlet. If I have uh, my own house in the future uh, that I can design, I'd like to have the Toto Washlet. Unfortunately, we have the 220 volts, otherwise I would already buy it. Um, it's just amazing. It's just everything you need to do to, uh, to do the washing, so you don't waste the toilet paper. Um, of course you waste energy because you need to heat up the, the, um, the stream, otherwise you're, you're behind the gets um, flushed with optimal video capture, yes. Yeah, but optimal, optimal, I don't have to be like too professional, but um, maybe I can ask. Huh. One, one moment. Um, the SD, SD card, uh -huh. I want to buy the, like, uh, this one. Micro SD? Yes. Okay. Memory card the phone will drop. Ah, so what's uh, the name of the Extreme Pro. Oh, I asked him which one do you recommend. I told you that is very important. Nothing micro SD. SD. Ah, SD. SD. Ah, so going there. What, what, what price? Mm -hmm. Tax-free? Uh, tax He's checking. Yes, yeah, a very cute, very friendly. Um, but I'm afraid I have my oh I have my passport, so I can do. Hey, Doctor D. This one is no no 4K. Oh, not, not this. Oh, okay.
Ah, yeah. So this one, this, do you have uh, this one, not 4K, but regular? Okay. So I need to buy the right one. Oh, so, somebody oh, help me. Oh, but I think this one is okay. Okay? Yes, I think so. This is this is class ten. Mm -hmm. This yeah. is good. Okay. Okay. This one. Yeah. So, so what price for this one? Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. Can I pay here? I have no idea what they will make. Visa credit? Visa credit more five percent discount. No, no, no. No? Okay. It's open? Okay? No, yeah, yeah. Oh. And sign free. Oh, okay. And it's actually signed. Thank you. I don't know. Double on your shelf. Okay, let's put it in. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Yeah, no. <laughs> I got it because I Japan. Yeah, a Thank you for the reminder. 
<laughs> yes, the, the passport. Uh, yeah, and oh. receipt. And receipt. Re sorry, oh, yes. Extreme, yes. Thank you so much. And uh, I'm sure it's okay, this one? Package. You can throw it away, yes. Okay, thank, thank you. you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, mission accomplished. Um, oh, I also want to have this one. Oh my god, it's just... Uh, it's just too much stuff. Let me think about the next. Oh yes, oh, I have to go downstairs because I need to pick up the four batteries for my Zoom. Because I, I bought a, um, the Zoom. That's where they normally are. Uh -huh. Because um, in Periscope, and um, hey Sam, I want to have uh, right now. We are live on uh, D Life, on Periscope, on YouTube, and on I forgot uh, Twitch. So the reason uh, why you see the comments like this because now you can on the left hand side the uh, icon. So we know exactly where the comments are coming from. Yes, I bought a Zoom H6n and I'm not out of batteries, but almost. Yes, the comments, I need to fix it, but I need to have my laptop with it to fix it. So I will fix, oh, I need to go down one more. You know this place, yes, it's one of the most one of the most famous places uh, in Akihabara where uh, many 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 tourists buy their uh, first time I was uh, <laughs> how do you how do you buy lino I don't want to buy the batteries I just uh, I, I don't want to say feel annoyed but I just want to get out here or maybe not. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe I'll, I'll just try. Let me check if I still have some money. The cost of the SD card: uh, sixty-three thousand yen, which is uh, not cheap. Not cheap at all, actually. But. Um, I have tried some fake SD cards and I lost um, I lost them. I lost lost not the SD card, I lost the video. Yes, we are traveling here and um, we are on the mission. Actually, we are on the mission for the dead cat. Uh, sorry, not the dead cat. <laughs> The black rabbit, but I already got it. The black rabbit is uh, like a black cat. You can put over your Zoom. Um, I just bought it in uh, in Japan, not in Japan. Sorry, in uh, Taiwan, uh, because I want to use it in Japan. And the next step, 
Oh my. This also looks so good. But maybe I shouldn't buy it. Oh no, I should think about, I don't want to say diet, but I should not just overeat. For Rodi, yes. So I'll, I will show you later. Oh, this is also really like Japanese. They have uh, those uh, small um, speakers. And then on top, you have the guy with the microphone. I'm cool. Very cool. <laughs> Japan number one. <laughs> I like it. Uh, yes, I th the... No, I didn't want to... The department starts. For me, it's... 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 Uh, it's um, really... I get so much, how do you call that? Uh, the sound and the, the lights, everything is so noisy. I, I just feel like I want to get out. I can... I can be there for about half an hour, but then it's over. I cannot handle it anymore. And I want to go one back, one more back to the to the front of the station. Yeah, actually, I want to do also more interviews here in, uh, in Japan, but uh, we will do that later uh, this week. Yeah, I prefer more the quiet places like, uh, uh, like the temple this morning. It's so relaxing and calming compared to this craziness which I also like but not for more than 30 30 minutes and I'll just my bra my brain crashes it's not because I am too busy in my head it's just the combination is not the best uh, to the software on Android actually I'm using right now an Android phone I'm using a Huawei phone and the software that I'm using is a Streamlabs. Um, Streamlabs in combination with iVideo. iVideo is a company that you can use for renting your um, your Wi-Fi, your 4G Wi-Fi if you're abroad. It's an amazing company because they will take care of you very good. Yes, the apps. Hey Linda, welcome back. I cannot read that. Hua. It's like Hua Shang Bei. <laughs> but then uh, ribbon the Hua Shang Bei. Hua Shang Lu. So. I think. It's here to the right. Ah, Huawei, Dwei. Huawei. Zhonghua de Hua, in way the way. <laughs> in a video game, yes, looks like it, huh? What, what I should do now? Uh, actually, I want to go to the JR Sen. But that is closed. And one of the things I still want to buy here is, is these. Uh, oh no, these are more if you want to hammer somebody. <laughs> <All right. laughs> if you have a, an incident. 
Where is the the live stick? Somebody was asking about the <laughs> of not getting fast. Somebody was asking me about the pH meter. I'm sure you can buy some over here. But I need to check again my position. Uh, but I prefer to put my phone somewhere. Maybe I can just walk around a little bit here and have a good possibility to reposition myself. Oh, that is too crowded. Yes, I think this is a... Yes, I have a GPS. So I will put you guys here on the top. Um, probably we have a better view like this. Oh, and then I need to check out what's the next step. I'm making a selling kebab. I want to show you the dead cat I bought. This is the dead cat here. And um, it's a beautiful dead cat. Especially um, very important if you want to use um, uh, like the surrounding size or if you want to do like interview. But this one is pretty big. So imagine you put this one to uh, wow in a sound production. So um, what I want to do later this week uh, to have um, maybe I can I can check already if the, the quality is good. I want to do like a like an interview and we have here the possibility to have uh, multiple channels. Hello one two three one two three test. Yes, that w we will also fit. I, I will have uh, I have both. Yes, uh, report the light. But um, I need to. Um, what I want to do is uh, use the outlet here. The I want to use the line out here, and then put it back into my um, Kulan, um <laughs> a badge. <laughs> yeah, good idea. But I want to have. Um, the output of this line out directly to my uh, to my phone, so you have a good quality um, a good quality input. Unfortunately, it cannot be stereo, but that's the um, basically that's the idea. So yes, there are a lot of things to do, a lot of things we can try. Um, it also depends what we are going to do, what time. Uh, but but prepare that we will at a certain time we will bring the black cat or the rabbit out. Um, but but let me let me have a look at um, at the map because um, I'm planning to go. Oh, it's already 11:30. Adapter for it. Yes, it is. Yeah. I, I bought it in, uh, in Europe. Oh, that's too far. I thought about walking to uh, Shimbashi, but we... Shimbashi Station. Let me have a look. If we walk there, it's about one hour. It's not that bad, actually. Shall we just do that? logo on the mic yes I know I, actually I was asked by uh, the Verge uh, people uh, the cryptocurrency they also have this year uh, another event um, so probably we'll also do that I think we should just walk at eh? 1130 1231 I, I feel a little bit in a hurry Ah, uh, what the heck, we just do it. 
let's do it. It's a it's Saturday. We can. Uh, I think we can manage it together with you guys. We can uh, we can do it. Um, one moment. One moment. I just need to think about the right direction. Hey, Chicago. Uh, because uh, I want to walk from here. Maybe I should follow that line, huh? Shimbashi. It's green. So we still can cross and hope this must be from Tennessee. All cool. Unstable signal. I think it's because of the uh, high rise buildings. Let me walk here to the left. Oh, really? Calligraphic. Like it. this here this is all really old stuff I don't want to say old in the sense that it's it's made a long time ago but this is really like a traditional electrical city things that they sold were selling here like small condenser condensator how do you call that resistors I got confused. We should cross here. Beautiful Sakura. It's getting hotter and hotter. Need to wait here. I'm using a gimbal, yes. Otherwise, you cannot. gimbal quality and also the um, I have the uh, hero 7 or something 
black. And my backpack. Oh, I don't want to talk about it <laughs> too much. I had a chat with, uh, with Mike the other day. Uh, we were talking about the uh, things we were bringing to, uh, to Japan and we, uh, <laughs> we had a, just a very, very easy conclusion is that most of the things we bring has to do with electronics and gadgets. And I have bought um, a load balancing Wi-Fi box which runs at 220 volts that can be used to, st to stack, basically combine two uh, SIM cards. But I hadn't had the opportunity to, uh, to install it, to test it. I'm just waiting for Mike. Yes, that's my idea. Uh, because then we can have a better upload speed. And the better your upload speed is, the more, I mean, the better quality, of course, you have, especially with a 360, that's important. But as you can imagine, 360, the amount of pixels is really limited. Hey, thank you, Japan Scope, for retweeting. the taxi or not the taxi the I know that route so well I prefer to have uh, something different Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, Dr. D, when are you coming to uh, Asia? Actually, I like more the smallest one. What's the best 360 camera? I think you should ask John Sabot. Follow him, John Sabot. John, J-O-H-N, Sabot in S-A-B-O-E, Sabo. He, I think he uses the Insta360. And you can check out his quality, which is uh, very, very good. Why do I mean very good? Is one, he is doing interesting stuff in Vietnam. For example, some markets, really local markets, and he knows his, uh, his stories about Vietnam, the local culture, the local activities. Not like me here in Japan. I mean, I'm just uh, just a guy that tries to help you. Hey, this. You're just selling the food in the street, basically, huh? You're from Japan. Welcome, welcome. Enjoy Japan. You're heading to Thailand. <laughs> That's good. Just want to cross the street over here. And now it's getting hotter and hotter and hotter. Hotto. Auto desk. Ah, Yakota. So I uh, used to study at Todai Daigaku. Todai. That's Tokyo University. Tokyo Daigaku. Which was also for me a uh, Really interesting experience. Okay. 
Hey, Richard boy, so where do you live right now then? In Tennessee? I forgot. I remember you. Hey, thank you, Swiffer. Not sure who Swiffer is. Or in Tennessee. I think I, when I'm back at the hotel, I need to change my gear. I mean, my, <laughs> my clothing. Because, uh, I want to walk here the small streets. I prefer the small streets. Lakelands University. No, I don't periscope from a PC. Uh, actually, I have thought about this uh, setup, but I thought if I do it like that, I just also need to travel around with an additional product and I'm already traveling. There's too many technology. I think I have a backpack, but maybe I need to put it on the front just to balance it a little bit more. Oh, Dennis guy. Ah, thank you for retreating though and inviting your followers. I'm uh, still alone, but uh, the other peeps will uh, meet me on Monday, but Sunday evening. We already have, as you can see on the top left, we will have Swiss Mike. Mike from Switzerland. He is uh, in Hong Kong right now. Probably he will do some, some scopes from there. I'm not sure what they were selling, maybe something from the government party or something. Hey, Ronan. I remember my longest stream ever was the one uh, of the 12 provinces. That stream, I forgot, but it was something like 12 hours. But um, they changed the rules lately that we are not allowed to download, upload, just have data for more than uh, five uh, gigabytes per day. And after those five gigabytes, you need to reload them. So that means that after those five gigabytes, you can put more, one more in it, but that means you will lose your stream. So you need to have a, like a load balancing one. run over by this guy. But I still feel it's pretty relaxed here, huh? Maybe we should push a button. Is there a button? No, nothing. Just need to wait. No, 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 uh, I think the people are really concentrated on those, um, those areas, huh? like Akihabara, like um, uh, the Meiji Shrine, like Tokyo Tower. Actually, I can see Tokyo Tower from my hotel. 
really similar to the Yamaha SR400, this one, by the way. And I have a Taiwanese uh, driver license. And I read you can translate it from Chinese to Japanese. And then I'm also allowed to drive motorcycles. Not the big ones, not the heavy ones, but I think up to 399 cc. Yes, I think it's 2.45. Or is it, no, I think it's 11.45 actually. Then I have a look. Yes, 11.45. I like these small streets, actually. There are also much smaller streets uh, around Tokyo because this is more like a grid. I would say like uh, um, American, you name what city grid, which makes walking around in those grids not so, in my opinion, pleasant. But it's uh, easy two cars on top of each other just to save the space because where should you put your Mercedes otherwise huh? Hawaii. Like a small detour, but just because I love the, the small street. Some war. Sad. Maybe I can just cross here. Otherwise, we need to wait again a long time for the green signal. I don't want to do that. But I also don't want to break the rules, Cherry. Cherry Swirl Girl. <laughs> Interesting name. Hey, John, where are you watching from? John Double Eight. Welcome again in uh, Tokyo, Japan. Actually, I haven't seen uh, many scooters around here. I'm not sure what's the reason for that. Maybe because it's not allowed. from Switzerland. Do you also feel, uh, follow Swiss Mike and JL Switzerland? If not, 
really recommend you to do. They are now in uh, Hong Kong. JL will uh, arrive soon. And I'm sure they have planned to do some interesting periscopes. Oh, great, great that you follow them. They're part of the Periscope family. I hope the video quality and also audio quality is still uh, good. You that chaw, you that chaw. We are now walking to you that chaw. Actually, this is also towards the Tokyo station. John because uh, this uh, video stream Wi-Fi is brought to you by uh, iVideo if you want to use them and you use my first name Casper as a name while you're buying some products I think you get a I forgot how much discount you'll get I don't get anything for it it's just they can track that you basically bought it using my channel. Just waiting for the green signal. I just want to be in the shade. Oh, it's green. What is amazing, what I think is amazing that used, how many gigs you used up till now? Yes, I know, I can check. But uh, I don't know right now. You can see it on the, on the, on the box, it says how many gigs you consume. more like the high-end area me too whole Ginza like the walking towards the like the fifth Avenue you could say Tokyo's fifth Avenue So I bought a SD card, but uh, I haven't had the opportunity to uh, use it. That's the reason why I prefer to have somebody with me. So one who can just take care of the camera, making pictures, and the other one, <laughs> but it will be me, <laughs> taking care of the video or vice versa. Yes, this is a... Uh, the, the business district so this is a very busy uh, in the during the week but right now people are doing other stuff of course the, over there there is the 
entrance of the Imperial Palace. Imperial Palace and there are, on the left hand side of the Imperial Palace from here you have the, um, the Diet Building and the Diet Building is the one from the government, the House of Parliaments in which they make the, the big decisions. And the Emperor, the Emperor lives, I mean the main resident is, he is over there and I heard that he will step down, if I'm correct, April 30 this year. Which is probably a big day for the Japanese, but um, it will be part of uh, an interview later on with uh, local Japanese. I'm not sure why we see this retreat. It's really refreshing clean. It seems to me here like in Switzerland, like a theme park. <laughs> Everything is well maintained and well structured. Isn't that cute, that little boy walking there? You don't see so many children, not here in general, but uh, I forgot the birth rate here compared to uh, many other countries is rather low. You should uh, have a birth rate, which is I think two point something in order to maintain the amount of people in a, in a country. Cleaner than in Switzerland, <laughs> maybe, maybe. And then you we can see on the left hand side, again, the Sto Tokyo station popping up. One of the buildings that was finished in 1914. And that building was, uh, they say, inspired, but somebody says it's not true or they haven't found the evidence for it. That this was inspired by the architect Kuipers from the Netherlands, because uh, this one seems to be a little bit like the Amsterdam Central Station. I was here about two hours ago, maybe more, three hours ago it was completely empty and now you can see more and more people walking around here the birth rate should be 2.5 in order to maintain country okay so what's the birth rate then in, in Japan maybe too many people making scopes instead of babies yeah, I, I prefer uh, to do not combine making babies with, uh, with periscopes. That would be just uh, not the way forward, but... Um, there's a delay. There's a delay, John. Uh, but one of the things... No, I, I lost my sentence. I lost my topic. Maybe it was talking about the birth rate. Yes, I don't know about the birth rate here in, uh, in Japan, but it must be very, very slow. Very, very low. But uh, periscopes uh, or live streams in general, um, you can just travel around 
with us and share the ideas. And at the end of the day, of course, you can uh, also meet other people. Back to the train depot, yes. So I had a very long chat with a chap here. Yeah. He, uh, he also lived in Japan, but he lived here for a couple of years, actually. What is my way? Ah, oh, I should go there. So the temperature for a super heart. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that, John. Hopefully we have uh, still opportunity, maybe in, uh, in a year, to cash out my $5 worth of cash. But I read that you need to have a, a US passport. From Illinois, what's the time now in Illinois? Probably in the evening now, huh? Temperature is now at 14 degrees Celsius, but it feels uh, more like 25. Two reasons. One, it's because the sun is burning on my head. Two, I'm power walking already for, uh, for 10 o'clock. I'm already power walking for about uh, three, four hours. I feel my knees uh, are getting more sore, sour, sore combination of it yes that was the central station Tokyo Central Station and on Monday very early morning together with Smith Mike we will get into the Shinkansen which is the, the train and uh, later probably today otherwise tomorrow uh, I will book a ticket on the train. So we are still in uh, Tokyo, Japan. And I like this really like a uh, Japanese style that they have uh, under the bridge. You can say water under the bridge, but this is like shops under the bridge. And Tokyo is like a, really like a metropolitan area. Um, I'm not sure how long it takes to get out of the city. It just depends, of course, which kind of um, way you will choose, but it's pretty huge. I forgot how many millions of people live around here. But that's really one of my list, just to get out of the city here and uh, enjoy the the really beautiful nature and unfortunately if you go by bus or by train uh, most of the time you will end up from one dense populated part to another less dense populated part but still a lot of people and I prefer just to uh, if possible to rent a car but we will do that in Shizuoka Shizuoka I think on Wednesday or Thursday and then we have the opportunity to have a better um, appreciation of the uh, local environment.
Yeah, so Swiss Mike and JL and John Ho. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure if they will meet up, but the plan is that they will meet 10 million about. Yeah, but that's Tokyo City. But the Tokyo metropolitan area might be even bigger, huh? I know, it's just really a lot. We just need to follow the train tracks. I like this construction. Looks also like uh, more than 100 years old. Probably it is actually, yeah. <laughs> it's Denmark, <laughs> yes. Denmark is also very flat <laughs> and they d they don't have Mount Fuji <laughs> Fuji-san yeah so maybe we also have the opportunity to uh, to have a look at Mount Fuji and to fly a drone around there and uh, during the week I also have some uh, meetings planned like uh, business meetings, you just need to uh, schedule it and situate it. Uh, United, what? 38 million. 38 million? No. That's a lot. And um, on the left-hand side, you have those very small restaurants. They are so small, basically, if you're with a group of five people, it's already full. So they serve usually some, uh, some alcohol with some small, um, yeah, some small, like barbecue or fried things. Yes, Tokyo is, uh, is crazy, so many people. Um, but on the other hand, if you just watch my scope in this morning, there were not a lot of people eh, in the street, so you just need to pick your time. And I don't want to say it's empty. So we are now walking uh, towards the west from Tokyo Station towards Shinbashi. And this is the Tokyo International Forum. And uh, I remember we had a meeting inside this, uh, this building. Oh, they even have Shake Shack here. Oh, yeah. Oh man, the world is changing. More glo global, global, global. 
Hey Bernie, you're more than welcome. Hopefully um, the scope inspires you to uh, save some money, save some time and just get out there one, one time and to enjoy and feel this Tokyo experience by yourself. Especially I'm really uh, sensitive for name for it but my nose is doing very very I don't want to say very well but it's very sensitive and also my nose can store all those different smells very well so the smell here in Tokyo is like a whole library of new uh, smells I've never I've never met them before here another the big camera but I don't want to get in just makes me feel uh, dizzy again um, the English ability so to, speak, so to say is getting better and better um, I even saw outside they're focusing on, uh, I mean, they have restaurants in which you can uh, just take this one, for example. Probably they have an, Eng an English, yeah, it's an English, you, yeah, it's very clear. You can have the healthy, relax or beauty. So it's very English uh, focused. No, just kidding. I think uh, in general, there's a lot of opportunity for for getting good quality uh, English menus. Maybe I'm losing you guys because of the buildings. Yes, I just wait for a better signal. I think we got a better signal here. I cannot guarantee, but I have seen um, the signals, especially uh, around the big buildings. It's not that bad, it's not that good. You already love Tokyo. <laughs> Imagine how I feel now. Overwhelmed in a positive way. like a shopping area Ginza Ginza is famous for uh, the uh, high-end brands there's somewhere the face mask uh, two reasons or three reasons but one of the most common reason is uh, the people want to, uh, they are usually they are sick, they don't want to infect others. That's the reason number one. Number two is just uh, protection against the uh, dust. But that's not really for, for this area. The weather is ridiculously good. I cannot imagine you can have better weather. So this is really like the, <laughs> that's reason number three, no makeup. <laughs> also always interesting to know why people are waiting here. You can see here the people. What are they buying? What are they buying? Usually it's something to eat. Uh, 
No, it's like a... I don't know, they bought something. I need to have a Japanese person look with me to know what is going on there. Uh, they have for LTE most of the time. So here you have a... Hey Bernie, yes, that's exactly the reason. I just want to show you the real deal and not like a YouTube polished version of everything. I just want to show you the real deal. Cool building, huh? I remember the Sony Tower must also be somewhere here. Here you have the Hermes. Hey Bernie, if you like this stuff, you can always um, share, like and subscribe. Retweet. And I would say just spread the message how great Tokyo is. Muji, maybe you have heard about Muji. Muji is one of my favorite stores in uh, Japan. They sell all kinds of, uh, I'm not sure how to describe that. Yeah, Swiffer, Swiffer bot, you're right. It's designed to do it like that, but in, I've seen a lot of people quit Periscope. A lot of people stopped using and streaming. And um, I'm one of the few people like with the other hardcore still using, using it to share because I think it's, um, a little bit selfish to enjoy Tokyo on your own. You need to share it. Here we have the Armani uh, stores. It's the Namiki Dori. I remember here, there's really delicious th things. <laughs> Bernie, thank you, really appreciate it. And if you're watching with Periscope, you can also share this broadcast to others. So it's more easy for other people to, uh, to find it. And if you follow the hashtag Travel Japan, um, basically also the other scopers that we will meet, including Swiss Mike JL um, and John Ho in random order. Of course, also Yuka, then you can follow also their periscopes. Yuka lives in Japan, so she's the local. Last year, uh, we were traveling in uh, Taiwan. Uh, at that time, I was the local. I brought the, the group around. And we also have John from LA, who's not a scoper in the sense that he scopes, but that's the one who will enjoy the traveling with us. And he is also a lot of fun. Rap, I, it's thanks to you. I, I didn't notice that. This is the citizen, very famous for the for the watch. And uh, now we are end up at the Di Ginza crossing, which is uh, the most important, uh, most famous crossing. It's not the one from Shibuya. I was yesterday at Shibuya. If you want to check it out, you can do that. LA. Oh, I'm not sure when I will be back in LA. But this is the famous uh, Ginza Tower uh, here on the right hand side. And in the evening, it's beautiful lit up. But right now, it looks a little bit uh, boring, I would say. <laughs> now we are. Oh, just for pedestrian, really like a pedestrian. Uh, towards the uh, south that's uh there used to be the tokyo fish market tsukichi the fish market that 
uh, it's a world famous fish market that will handle the most of the fish all around the world. Usually they live in small apartments. And that is the, the flip side, I would say, of, uh, of the Japanese uh, area here. That not everyone can achieve a house with a garden and 100 square meter for themselves. Usually they don't live in very big apartments. But nevertheless, you can also be happy and you need to be happy also with this smaller area. It's not all about size, huh? Let's have a look at the map again. Mm, I need to... I'm originally from Holland, from the Netherlands. Europe. Um, hotel, my taste. Should go to the right somewhere here. I want to visit Holland too, Netherlands. Wow, cool. Bernie, you're always welcome to visit the Netherlands. And uh, if you DM me, I can help you in, if possible. And if I am available, I am happy to show you around Amsterdam area. I think Amsterdam is also a cool place to be. But what I don't like about the Amsterdam area is uh, it's too touristic at the moment. And I mean, uh, too many tourists will destroy uh, a certain vibe. Maybe you agree or disagree. Oh, by the way, this is a very uh, famous building. This is like the opera or the theater. But I have to go this way. And Tsukiji Fish Market is on the left hand side. And uh, they moved it recently to another place. And uh, a lot of people were afraid that not only the vendors, uh, but also the small restaurants around it will just move. But somebody told me that still the famous fresh sashimi still be around. No, you should definitely not avoid Amsterdam. I think definitely uh, should uh, have a look around there. But uh, it's a lot of people say, oh, I've been to Holland. I've been to Holland. I was in Amsterdam. I thought, yes, Amsterdam is located in the kingdom of the Netherlands. Yes, it's located in one of the kingdom of kingdoms, which is countries, which is the Netherlands. Yes, but Amsterdam is not uh, <coughs> like everything what our country has so definitely want to help you because people sometimes forget to uh, to really see the uh, smaller villages like Delft area Delft or Leiden Utrecht or Maastricht or Nijmegen there are so many beautiful areas You're completely right. Uh, it's river bot. I mean, New York City, that's not America. <laughs> but of course, people have been in New York City. Maybe they feel like I've been in America.
But I really appreciate if people visit different countries to understand different cultures. Uh, one of the parts is uh, to also speak some words of the, yeah, of the local language. Meet locals, interview them. It's uh, like my style and that's what I like. Yeah, get out of the capital, move around, hire a boat and enjoy the scenery. Oh, what's that? I think we don't have any juice anymore. Let's have a look. Oh, <laughs> yes. Yes, yeah, easy to read, but what I also think is important for the people who are watching uh, using Twitch or YouTube. Um, and they also have the opportunity to watch uh, the, either the live stream or the, the replay. Because otherwise the, uh, the messages from the periscope, the periscope are lost. And once they get burned into the screen, it's more easy for people to share and to use it. I remember I was here a couple of years ago with my... Uh, uh, oops, I really think the battery is dead. Need to choose up. Eighty percent, I think. <laughs> I think ninety. <laughs> uh, but um, if you want to take advantage of the battery pack, you need to make sure that the battery drainage is not bigger than the one you can u juice it up. <laughs> and uh, I'm, I'm afraid I'm just using too much energy at the moment. It's not good for my carbon footprint, this, huh? But uh, I hopefully they use uh, green energy to give me the electricity. Oh, this is not smart. I need to, I think I need to take a bridge. Hey Mike, prepare for a long walk with me. <laughs> no, just kidding. Just, uh, I remember this uh, part. There we have, uh, that's really cool. Um, like the man-made islands. Fly to Japan, why? Why are you worried about it, Mike? It's not that far. <laughs> the common the access food. Yeah, I think in that way we should just uh, all stay at home eh? and all watch people, local people, periscoping.
Uh, I, I don't know where to go actually. Nobody is helping me. What's the direction of the hotel? Probably here. Walk down over here, so I have to go uh, right, left, left, left. So somebody asked about how many data I use. So I can zoom about 300 kilobytes, like 0.3 per second. So times 60. And you can calculate how many megabytes per per hour. <laughs> Good thing, Dean. Some uh, German culture over here. Porsche. Yeah, you all follow J uh, Mike. Hey, Mike, what are you doing? Are you walking around in Hong Kong now? I heard the other day that uh, big companies like Shell, they are planting uh, some uh, forests. But actually, there are people very angry about that um, idea because maybe it will reduce the carbon footprint, but will, it will destroy the biodiversity in certain areas. So, yeah, hey, w welcome. Swarte Dam. Welcome here in, in Tokyo, Japan. So Mike, to give you an idea, I'm uh, walking from the Akihabara electronic uh, town to uh, Uh, to the hotel. And uh, hotel is, let me have a look. It's on this street. So green means you have to run, huh? Yes, we made it. Yeah, so John Sabo is uh, asking for people that got scammed uh, while they were traveling. And Bernie, love to see you back again. And as you might know, there are replay buttons. So if you miss something, you can always go back where you left us or see you and catch you on the next one. Stinky perfume. I'm not sure if that's the best in the world, but I know it's one of the craziest places. I think the best in the world, of course, depends how you define best. But uh, hey, Shinkansen.
there's a Shinkansen. But uh, I know that uh, Shenzhen is, in my opinion, uh, it's just a different dimension. Shenzhen just across the border of uh, Hong Kong and China. What is going on over there? It's like a, a different order of magnitude. So we need to wait here. We have the right signal. The red signal, I'm sorry. My feet uh, definitely need some rest. <laughs> Sometimes they will show you how long you need to wait for the traffic line, but this one doesn't show that. And uh, then you're waiting here in the burning sun. waiting for the light and let me have a look at the place I have to meet later um, where are you are oh, here Hamari Q. Hamari Q. Shio Dong. Shio Dong. Let's have a look. Oh, that pr person was a pretty uh, far away. Um. Let me have a look at my next meeting place. Ah, Shio Dome. Ah, we're going to the Imperial Garden. Lovely, lovely. Actually, I'm almost there, huh? Just 20 minutes. Oh, sorry, guys. I messed up. Yeah, I will go later to the um, to the garden, so-called Hama Rikyu garden and they are near to the uh, to the sea and um, he's a he's a local 
Tokyo local person, so he definitely must know where we uh, have to go. Just here, the chopper somewhere. Uh, Periscope, where are you? I don't know why the electronics is getting sick. I think I have not used the right power connection. Hey, daddy for you, baby. Welcome here in Tokyo, Japan. Welcome here in this lovely street. And what we are doing right now is just uh, have a, like a walk and talk. And if you're from Mexico, then it's pretty late in the evening. And I'm happy that you can enjoy some of the glimpse here, the Tokyo glimpse, before we are ending this live stream. I think it was a uh, for me a great experience to be here with you guys to to show you here some of the activities in uh, Japan um, I remember you had breakfast with uh, with me if the people just were following me from the from the beginning we, we were just moving around oh Really, the technology is uh, is failing. I think because uh, the connector I have is not well connected to the to the phone. Yeah, so we had a shopping experience together. We were in this crazy, you know, the bus. We saw how uh, oh the temple. Yes, we also went to the temple. That was also a lovely experience. I think the Kanda. Yes, and right now we are back uh, near my hotel. I forgot actually to, to check whether it's really this street, but I think, I mean, I remember it's this street, huh? You love Japan. I think a lot of people love Japan. It's uh, my love for Japan has to do with the uh, the interest of the culture, which is completely different than from from us, which in a certain way uh, is in interesting. Like I want to learn. I want to understand. I want to dig into. Yes, Olympics 2020. And I already saw some. Yeah, we got chased out. <laughs> yes, true. Let me think about what other things we saw today. Yeah, we saw the beautiful shrine in the morning. A uh, drink, of course, a cup of coffee. We saw a drunk person, uh, yes, and there was really walking. Here you can see the, the ladies, the students. These are uh, different bags than the ones I was talking about. Yes, Mike, I need to, to fix this. But I know how to do that. We see a lot of, I saw a lot of tourists actually, yeah. Usually I can say, oh, I'm not a tourist, but actually I am today. Or you could say, I'm just working for the Periscope group. I'm the tour guide. I was the only one who was working. You were just enjoying. 
just a different perspective of things. I think if I do more scopes, it's good, good for my body health because I don't eat so much with you. I don't drink so much with you. It just... Uh, I will just keep on moving. Moving. Come on, come on. Where is the... That's my hotel. I thought it was here. Did I lose you? I know. Yeah, you were my partners. A very good partners. You were helping me out in the difficult times where I hadn't any clue about the name of the shrine. I've learned that Japan has even more people than I thought. More than 9 million people only in the Tokyo smart small area no my hotel room is really really small i i didn't know i thought i was booking uh, to a different hotel but this hotel is also not too bad i mean i have stayed at better places let me put it that way and you cannot walk around the bed um I cannot put my suitcase open and still walk around. <laughs> there we are, hotel. Here. But I have a view of Tokyo Tower. Yeah, thank you so much for being here with, uh, with me. And if you think about hotel uh, we use uh, my states used my states uh, also before also with my brother actually two years ago three years ago thank you so much for being here with me and uh, with this view i just want to end thank you so much